This tutorial shows how to add custom fields to JetBlock, SmartList and SmartTiles widgets. For everything to work properly, you'll need to install Advanced Custom Fields plugin. It is free and you can download it from WordPress org. The link is attached below this video. While using this plugin, you won't need to look for meta key in your website database. It really makes the process much simpler, so here we go. I did a bit of preparations myself, so I've already created the custom fields. In the case you need to create them, just navigate to Custom Fields tab and here you can see the fields that exist on your site created with the Advanced Custom Fields plugin. To add the fields to the JetBlock widgets, we'll need the meta key, and we can retrieve it right there. Just click Edit and here is the field name you need. Let's copy it to the clipboard. We'll also make sure that this custom field is located where we need it. I added this field to post type post, but you can add it to any post type you need, like products or pages. Ok, let's update the changes. If the changes were successful, you'll see the green notice in the upper side of the screen. Now let's go to Posts All Posts and here fill the needed value in the custom field we've created. Just scroll down the page and type in the text you want to display in this custom field. Now let's go to Elementor Editing page, where we are going to add the Smart Post Lists widget. I drop the widget to the section where I need it. Then I scroll a bit down and open Custom Fields block. Here you can choose if you want to add a custom field beside the title or beside the content. I enable Show Meta Before After Title option. Let's click Add Item button to add a new field. I needed the key we've previously copied from the Advanced Custom Field Subtitle field block. As you can see, now there is the subtitle above my product title. OK. Now let's change the meta field's position if you want the field content to show up below the title. Select after from the drop down list. Let's see how the custom fields work for another JetBlock widget. This time we'll be adding Smart Post Tiles widget. I drop it to the content area. Well, here it is. This time let's imagine we need to display the product's post type instead of the posts. I open Query and Controls and here I select the needed post type from the drop-down list. Once again I open Custom Fields block. Here we'll be adding our custom field before or after title, so I turn on the corresponding option. Let's click Add Item. And here you need to fill in the key that is used for the WooCommerce product price. In our case it is a regular price key. Let's add a label before the price value. I type in Price Label. I also select After Meta Fields position. That's actually all. Now you know how to add custom fields to JetBlock Smart Post List and Smart Post Styles widgets. Thanks for watching this video.